Hi viewers, today we will discuss about the difference between artificial intelligence, machine learning, deep learning and data science. So, first one we will see about artificial intelligence. So here artificial intelligence in the sense already we know a uh, human intelligence. So here that uh, intel uh, machines will be uh, think like a human intelligence so that's why uh, that uh, that is called artificial intelligence so here that artificial intelligence enables the computer to think to do the task automatically without any human intervention and when it is doing the uh, things or task automatically so it has to decide itself what kind of task to do next and when the task to be done and how the task will be happen or to be done. So this kind of things has to be decided machine itself. In that uh, scenario, uh, uh, humans should not intervene in that process. So that is called artificial intelligence. For example, uh, driverless car. So in the driverless car, the, the car itself uh, sends the uh, environment that environment is uh, sensed by uh, sensors and collects that data then uh, it will be uh, processed by the uh, learned model then it has to be uh, decide either it is go straight or take uh, left or uh, right side like that so the tasks will be uh, decided by the car itself and when it, it has to be when when that which kind of activity has to be done and how it has to be done that all the things have to be decided by uh, the machine itself that means car itself then next one is chatbot in the chatbot also that has to be uh, interact with the user or uh, just it may be a one way uh, whatever user is uh, seeking the information the chatbot has to be uh, present to the user and next one is uh, the machine learning so the machine learning is the subset of artificial intelligence so artificial intelligence is the uh, vast area that in that vast area that machine learning is uh, subset so that subset uh, that subset will uh, collects the data from the environment already we know uh, the sensors are collecting the data uh, uh, from the environment so here that machine learning provides the statistical tools that statistical statistical tools uh, explores that data in depth and that explored data will be analyzed by the statistical tools so here that uh, using that statistical tools the machine learning will teach the computer how to make accurate predictions from the collected data so in machine learning again we are having the four types of uh, learning techniques one is supervised and another one is unsupervised learning uh, third one semi supervised learning and fourth one reinforcement learning or uh, in supervised learning uh, the labels target labels will be given then uh, that model will predict the uh, target uh, ta predict the output and that output will be compared with that given target label but in unsupervised learning target labels will not be given the the predicted output will be decided and classified that target labels in semi supervised learning uh, uh, that the, from the given data some of the data may have target labels and some of the data may, may not have target labels that means suppose if you are having the thousand samples in that thousand samples uh, maybe 600 samples may have the uh, target labels and remaining 400 samples may not have target labels so it is the combination of uh, supervised and unsupervised learning and fourth one is reinforcement learning in that reinforcement learning uh, that model uh, sends the environment based on that actions will be taken so this is another kind of another kind of learning model then uh, third one is uh, deep learning in that this deep learning is a subset of machine learning so 
uh, artificial neural networks will be used to explore the data and that neural networks will be used for analyzing the collected data and also why it is called deep learning in the sense here uh, the neural network will use many many layers uh, in artificial neural in machine learning mostly they will use the single layer neural network single uh, layer neural network but in deep learning they will use many layer, neural network layers that's why that is called deep learning so mostly the deep learning will be used for uh, computer vision and uh, uh, voice processing and uh, temporal kind of data and fourth one is the data science the data science is here just study about the collected data so it involves uh, it involves uh, different kind of methods uh, to record store and analyze the stored data effectively uh, it which extracts the useful information from the uh, given stored data then the goal of the data science is uh, to get the depth knowledge about uh, collected data so the data may be a structured or unstructured and the data science is playing uh, with all three technologies that is uh, super set uh, artificial intelligence then machine learning and deep learning so all the three technologies will be useful used by a uh, data science and the major role of uh, uh, data science is uh, pre process and post processing data the it process the data collected data only so it will not create any models it will just pre process the collected data and post process to present to the user so this is the major uh, uh, at the outset ai is the uh, superior to these technologies uh, uh, machine learning is just uh, machine learning is just uh, provides the statistical tools to uh, analyze the data and uh, deep learning uh, it uh, it is also used uh, analyzing the data but it uses the uh, deep neural networks data science just study about the uh, data and it uses the different models already developed so it will um, mostly work uh, place with the pre processing and post processing of the collected data so thanks for watching thank you